James Clapper was Obama's director of national intelligence, and just like everyone else in the Obama administration, he's never held accountable for breaking federal laws. There was no wiretap against Trump Tower during the campaign conducted by any part of the national intelligence community. Big laws, the kind of laws that would put the little people, like you and me, into prison for a long, long, long time. But just like every other law, these laws don't apply to the ruling class because those laws were never meant for them anyway. You know, laws like lying to Congress. Does the NSA collect any type of data at all on millions or hundreds of millions of Americans? No, sir. The director of national intelligence in March did directly lie to Congress, which is against the law. And now more recently, we have discovered that James Clapper was the source of the leaks during the Trump transition something that we suspected now they've confirmed, which is that uh, Clapper actually was the guy leaking information, specifically leaking information, I believe, from that January 6th meeting where they briefed President Trump, then President-elect Trump, on the dossier, and someone at CNN got information we think it was Mr. Clapper who gave it to him. But as I said, it's time to be honest with ourselves and stop imagining the kind of America that only existed in Norman Rockwell paintings. It's time to acknowledge it's not a matter of two different sets of laws. There are only one set of laws. But there are two kinds of people. The people that matter and the people that don't matter. And you and I, my friends, fit squarely in the category of people that don't matter. We don't belong to the class of people that are immune to the law. The class that they create and impose these laws to protect themselves from the profane. Those laws were never intended to be used against the ruling class. They exist only to keep you and I, the profane, in line and from time to time remove undesirables from the ruling class. You know, when assassination would be too messy. So James Clapper, who has lied to Congress, leaked classified information to CNN and God knows what else, is rewarded with a government pension and a cushy job working for the Mockingbird Media. CNN national security analyst and former director of national intelligence, James Clapper. Having proven himself an expert at lying, his countless ruling class peers that enjoy the same immunity from the rule of law will never face the consequences, even when the evidence is on video and publicly available, because if the ruling class were to prosecute them, it would mean forfeiting the same immunity that they enjoy. Not to mention the disclosure of whatever blackmail material has been gathered on all of them, because that's the way things work in a criminal enterprise and in cults. And the criminal cult in Washington is no different than your run-of-the-mill organized crime family. The only difference is that they have deluded themselves into thinking that we are the profane, which makes them far, far more dangerous. For Blackpilled, I'm Devin Stack. If you like my videos, make sure you like and subscribe and also hit the notification bell so you know when new videos are posted. You can also donate to patreon.com forward slash blackpilled or to the crypto addresses below. And I'm still working on getting that PayPal address for you guys. So stand by for that.